St. John's from the opening tip played like their life depends on every game for the rest of the season. That they need to win every single game out pretty much to make sure that they are in the NCAA tournament. And that's what it looked like. And it would have been a sin if they lost that game, to be honest with you. You know? Because they played so well and so hard, and they played like they were the better team. And they were. So why did they only score 38 against Marquette? Because their two best players went five for 36 or whatever the hell it was. And tonight they made shots. They made big shots when they had to make big shots. So when you play a team that's playing for their life against a team that came out, you know, we're entitled to the Big East tournament, I mean, to the Big East championship, you know? So each team got what they deserved, 100%. 100%. Is that a concern, Gino, the way your players are approaching games right now? No. It's who they are. And, you know, it's the downside of playing at UConn for some kids. You have to show up every night and bring it. That's it. And not everybody's capable of doing that. It's, it's just reality right now, you know? Um, what? No. So, you know, sometimes you can look at stats and you can try to rationalize whatever you want. But um, I think it goes beyond that, you know. You can you know, you can always make stats whatever you want them to be. Um you know, St. John's bench scored 29 points. That's a stat. And um, what do we get up eight in the third quarter? And then we do what we do a lot, but we kind of overcome it is then we just start self-inflicting, you know, punishment on ourselves. So we can't go from 8 to 12 or 8 to 15 or, you know. Instead, it goes 8 to tie score. <laughs> there's, you know, there's a point in time now, this late in the season, where you have to really find something else inside you because your tank is running dry almost, you know? So you got to really, really, really mentally, you know, get yourself in a place where you can still function and um, you say, well, we did it Saturday, you know? We did it against Creighton, but we didn't do it tonight. And you say, well, how would you explain that? I think that's probably normal. Because in, norm in a normal world, you would also do what Joe did. You would go to your bench and some guys come off the bench and pick up some guys who aren't playing really good that are starters. And we don't have that right now. You know? So, I 
I think I've said this before, nothing that this team does surprises me. No matter how good we play, I'm not surprised because we can. And no matter how bad we look, I'm not surprised because we can.